I'm going to give random people hundreds of thousands of dollars. Is this for real? What? It's for real? <laughs> oh my god. Here's how. This is me. And I'm pretending to be a news reporter. And I emailed a bunch of random people asking if my news station could interview them. Little do they know this interview isn't real and I'm gonna give them tons of money. We don't have graphics, so enjoy this. <laughs> Psych! Hello and welcome to NBSND News. This is my co-anchor Chris and we just wanted to interview about the, you know, recent pandemic and see how you're doing. Right as the economy started tanking, like my job laid off a third of the company in like Jeez. one day and it was out of nowhere. Wow. Right? wow. We were about to close on our first house as a family. So everything in our future became like immediately uncertain. Okay, that's a lot to yeah. take in. We are just trying to help people and make their lives a little better. So we'd like to give you $10,000 to make everything going on a little bit easier for you. What? Yeah. For uh, real? Yeah, yeah actually our, our news viewership has gone up and we've been pretty fortunate, so we wanted to give back to some people. No, dude, I never thought I'd be on Mr. Beast's <laughs> Oh wait, you know who oh we are? Oh my god. Nah, come on. I mean MB and C, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, no, it's fine. You know, maybe times are hard. Maybe you had to go pick up a job at MB and S and D, you know? I guess we don't need the globe anymore. <laughs> thank you so much, guys. That's super, super helpful. Like for real. Genuinely, thank you. Yeah, we'll get you the money after the interview. Thanks for coming. In. Oh my gosh, thank you so much guys. No problem, later. And now it's time for the next interview. How's it going? Finding yourself? Good. So we're WMSMB. Could you tell us how like, you know, the global pandemic going on has affected you? I never thought that the whole world would just stop. I mean, I live in New York City, so you know, at the beginning I kind of was essential at my job and at the end I wasn't. You've been laid off recently? Yeah. My last day of work was the 20th. It hurts to hear all this. So um, here at WSMB, we want to give you $10,000 to try to make your life a little bit easier. That's just crazy. That's just insane. Oh, you're about to make me cry. Okay. Trying to make a decision whether to take a job, you might get sick. Hopefully the $10,000 makes it where you don't have to pick uh, you know, a job that can potentially get you sick. Rent will be paid. Maybe I can get a good night's sleep tonight and I can pay it forward like you guys did to me. Aw, I'm glad MBWSN has been able to help you. Awesome. Thank you. Bye. No, no problem. I'll see you later. Bye. All right, Jimmy, I think it's time for our next interview. All right, next one. He's waiting in the lobby. I'm gonna admit him and start the interview. This is my co-anchor, Chris, and we just wanted to hey. interview about the you know, recent pandemic and see how you're doing. It was really scary for me. I got hit hard financially because like, I was in the hospital for four days and not working right now. You I'm actually going. got the virus? I got the virus, wow. yeah. So you were forelode from your job, you then got yeah. the virus, and now you're stuck with medical bills? 15 grand is what I've heard so far. Obviously, like, not working and living in San Francisco like I'm like where am I gonna find that yeah yeah um hold up one second break one, one second one sir I gotta talk to my news anchor yeah, we gotta take care yes. of this oh, okay hey so we here at MBS NDC GDBY news mm -hmm. would like to give you fifteen thousand dollars to cover your hospital bills also I'm not a real news anchor this is fake but everything is fake here we just like giving away oh, money you guys helping like this means a lot thank no you problem, so man. thank you guys so much I really appreciate it no problem thank you I hope you have a good day man how do you get on with your day after great news like this <laughs> I hope you guys have been enjoying the news today now before we get into our next interview, my anchor Chandler has a cool stat. There are more fake flamingos in the world than there are real. What a shame. All right, let's jump right into the next interview. Hello, and welcome to WMBSC and DC News. How are you doing, sir? I'm doing all right, as best as can be in these mm -hmm. crazy times, but uh, making the best of it, I suppose. We've got some intel that you've fallen on rough times. Could you tell us a little bit about what's going on in your life? Went to school all year was two weeks away from my state board license, about to get a job, and all of this happened. So school debt, no money coming in, no mm -hmm. possible yeah. job opportunity, blew through all my savings. It sounds like a lot has not been going your way recently. And would you say if we were to, you know, give you $10,000, that would make your life a little bit better? Well, yes, that would make life a lot easier right now and put this huge smile on my face. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> We're actually not even a real news station. No. I'm just an idiot. I'm not. Though. But the money is real, though. This is the most amazing thing I've heard. Thank you for coming out to this interview. I'm glad we could help you. I mean, you guys, really, thank you so much. That's It's epic. That's It's life-changing. <laughs> no problem. Thank you for coming out. We appreciate you here at WMVSC ND News. We are now college professors. Our college, Blash University, is doing a comprehensive, in-depth study to see how the pandemic is affecting people and also giving away a bunch of money. 
How has uh, the recent pandemic affected you? I am out of work. As soon as they heard about it, we were shut down. So I rely on mostly family. How does that make Blast University feel? All right, so we here at Blast University want to help you out. How does $5,000 sound? Do you think that would help alleviate some stress from your life? $5,000. Yeah. A lot. I can pay a lot of bills. <laughs> <laughs> We're glad we could help you. I'm glad you could help me. I'm glad. That's Everybody's a... glad. Yes. 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 Everyone's glad. glad. Uh, it's a very emotional moment. Thank you for uh, participating in our YouTube video. <laughs> you had no idea what was going on. I was totally shocked. Got him. Got him. Hey. Hey. Break. So here's the thing. This woman right here, Sarah, is Chris's sister. And Chris's sister helps train other teachers. So she teaches teachers how to be teachers. And we got Sarah's from to jump in one of her calls and give all the teachers she's teaching today money. Hello everybody, can you guys hear us? Hi. What's it like for you guys uh, with all this <laughs> pandemic going on? I still go in every day and try to make some contact with students, but it's just been different. We appreciate what you guys are doing. So we want to give each one of you a thousand dollars. Oh my oh god! My god. What? Oh my god! Yeah. Yeah. Well, that was really all. We can let you guys go back to whatever you're doing. We just wanted to give you money. <laughs> yes, thank you. Thank you. I need y'all to work on your math. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Oh, they're making us do homework. I'm leaving. Bye. Hello. Everything going good? It's going okay. Awesome. We're professors at Blast University, and we're just doing a study real quick. So, Chris, I'll let you take it away. We just wanted to see how the uh, recent events have affected people. How have you been finding yourself with all these uh, things going on? My second job is closed. My full-time job, hours are, like, reduced bad. So I had to go online with school. So, wait, you were working two jobs and going to school at the same time? Yes. We here at Blast University would like to give you $5,000 to help make things a little bit easier on you. <laughs> are you serious? We are very yes. serious. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> well, thank, I don't know what to say except for thank you. You're no very problem, welcome. Ma you will make things a lot easier on me, and I really do appreciate it. Wow, well, I'm kind of speechless. Well, thank you for participating. We'll take care of sending you the money, and I'll talk to you later. Thank you. No problem. You're Bye. Welcome. That went very well. We should be actual college professors. All right, next set. I now work for a real estate company. I thought we were construction. Yeah. Oh, I work for a construction company. And this construction company is building lots of homes, so we're curious if people are still gonna buy them. And we also wanna give away money. Hey, how's it going? Uh, going very well, how are you? Good, sorry, um, I'm a CEO and founder of a construction company, C-R-A-L-L. -L. We just build buildings and stuff like that for real estate. Do you have time yeah. for a quick survey? Yeah, I guess so. Uh, financially and everything, things been good or has the pandemic affected you negatively? The pandemic has definitely affected us negatively. I got uh, laid off from my job. Supposedly- You got laid off? My whole team just kinda got gutted. Pick a number between one and 10. Nine. Do you think $9,000 will help make your life better? Yeah, I think $9,000 would be amazing. Well then, right after this call, I'm gonna wire you nine grand to try to make things a little less stressful for you. Uh, thank you. Yeah, Who I actually, I, I'm not actually a real estate owner. I make dumb YouTube videos. I'm a little beside myself, I, but I just thank you. Thank you so much. All right, have a good day, guys. See you guys, bye-bye. Can you hear me? Oh no. What? <laughs> Uh, do you know who I am? Mr. Beast. Oh, okay. <laughs> that kind of blows my cover. Since you know who we are, I might as well just cut to the chase. Yeah, we're not actually a construction company. We're actually just giving people money. Oh, wait, actually, before we jumped ahead, uh -huh. I need to ask, how's the pandemic affected you? Right now, we're out on leave due to the pandemic, so that affected me and my kids a lot. What's two times four? Eight. Is that right? Eight it is? Eight thousand, there we go. Oh my God, I'm, I'm speechless right now. I really am, because like, I follow you guys on YouTube and stuff, and I so love y'all. Like, mm -hmm. yeah. Thank you. We're, we're gonna let you go. Thank you for coming on. All right, thank you. Okay, well, thank gosh. That was great. We called her. In between that clip you just watched and this one, me and Chris went to law school and we are now practicing lawyers. You look like you want to sell me a cure to something I don't have. Even though we're lawyers now, things are still the same. We're giving away money. <laughs> Hello, welcome to the call. How are you doing? <laughs> Hey, I'm fine. How are you doing? Good. Would you say Nothing. you like money? I love money. Perfect. All right, <laughs> your settlement has been figured out. $5,000. I know this is very confusing, but we're going to send you $5,000 because we here at Bailey Bailey feel like no one should ever get laid off. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I, you, listen, I have a 17 month old son that I take care of. Myself. Really? Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. My little kinky, he is going to be, he's going to get everything. Oh my god. That's really the gist of it. We just wanted to give you some money. Jimmy and Bailey from Bailey and Bailey. Yes, yes thank you. I'm I do just gonna the say company. they are the best people in the world. <laughs> we need to take this next client very serious, okay? Yes. 
Very, very serious. Here, I'll put my files away. Thank you. My name is Jimmy, and this is my partner. His name's also Jimmy. We we work at J&J Law Firm. Could you tell us, you know, in the last few months, how you've been affected financially? Well, I haven't worked since March the 10th. She's laid off. Mm -hmm. I think that's a, a wrong due settlement. I think she should settle for around $5,000. Yep. Uh, but instead of the company, we should just pay it. Okay, because that's logical. Okay, um, we want to give you $5,000. Is this for real? Yeah, I think, uh... Yeah, it's real. Okay. Like, mm -hmm. jokes aside, after this call, we're gonna wire you $5,000 to make your life better. I haven't had a car since last August. I think I might be able to buy me a car. Really? Yeah. Is this for real? It's for real. real. It's for real. Yeah, it is for real, for real. I promise. Thank y'all. Yes, no problem. I'm kinda handsome, too. <laughs> Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. Me and Chris are now chefs. Pizza pasta. What's our restaurant, McDonald's? Or that's actually a restaurant. Um, Welcome to Slammy's, what's your order? Oh, we're joining. We joined the call by hitting the desk. Hello, can you hear us, sir? Yes, sir. How's your day going? It's going well, how about yourself? Has this pandemic affected you financially? Yes, it has. In what way? Besides uh, uh, food, a little bit of food every now and again, paying my rent, making the problem. Let me, here, let me meet with my colleague, hold on. What do you think Slammy should give him? I think Slammy. <laughs> I think should give him. So anyway, sir, I'll cut right to the chase. We want to give you five thousand dollars to help make your life better. Oh man, that'd be great, man, for real. Yeah, I just I hope you have a good day, man. I greatly appreciate you, brother. I fired the other chef, and this is my new companion. Hello. Don't drop everything. What'd you say? And in case you're wondering, the mess is still on the floor. All right, this is kind of hard, so we're just gonna give you money. You want five thousand dollars? Oh. Stop! Oh my God, are you joking? We do want to help you and give you oh five thousand. Oh my God! Right now, I'm not receiving any financial assistance for school. I'm without a job because I was let go last August. Yeah, man. That's and that's why we're doing this. Did you think we were chefs? Yeah, I mean. Well, actually, when when he ate the raw pasta, I was like, mm, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, God. we're not actually chefs. All right, thanks, thanks for coming out, man. Much. I'll catch you later. See you. Thank you. I thought you guys were chefs until you ate the raw pasta. Yeah, I figured that would give it away. These next few people think we're talking to them for our documentary we're making on the pandemic. But we're just gonna give them money. This is my partner here, Chandler. We're oh. currently working on a documentary and we're just interviewing some people for it. What's one of the first things you wanna ask them? Well, how has the pandemic affected you? It's really stressful because I'm, you know, not working. Not working? Did did you get laid off? I have a stage four liver cirrhosis. Oh. How about this? Uh, if we give you ten thousand dollars, do you think that would take some stress out of your life? Yes. All right. Well then, yeah. let's do okay. it. Uh, we're not actually filming a documentary. I'm just a YouTuber that gives away money. This is a two dollar shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it just helped me a lot because I'm not able to go to work and then have to be by myself. It's just stressful. Not to, like have nobody in your corner. I'm glad we were able to give the money to you though, because it does seem like yeah. you need it. And thank you, thank you for coming on. Oh gosh, wow, that was a lot. We cut off our camera, his is still on. And look, oh my gosh, he's yeah. balling. That last clip was for Chandler's documentary. Now what's your documentary about? The man with two fedoras. I'd watch. And now, now one fedora. I'm gonna pick that up real quick. Oh. <laughs> We're gonna join, I'm gonna let you take the lead. It's your documentary. All right, hello, how's it going? Oh wow! Hi. What? Do Do you recognize us? Yeah, you're Mr. Beast. Yeah. Do you know my name? <laughs> if I'm not mistaken, I think you're Chris. Oh. Okay. Do you know his name? <laughs> <laughs> Chandler exists. I Everyone. Just love how everyone started laughing when Chandler walks in. Someone told me that uh, you don't have a car and that you got laid off, right? Yeah. We can't yeah. have that. At the moment, we're not currently Mr. Beast. We're actually a documentary crew, and Chris is filming a documentary, and I don't feel like going along with this bit. You know what? How about this? You want $10,000? <laughs> actually, how about I digress a little bit? We've spent almost $200,000, mm -hmm. but I want to give her more money. Okay. How about $15,000? Whatever you offer, is I'm, I'm grateful for. I mean, at the word, actually, I can get my family out that infestation bit. We're living in and I don't have to worry about my wife dying in the vehicle that we have now. Thank you for coming on. Thank you for having me. And there you have it guys. We gave away a lot of money. Thank you so much, honey, for sponsoring this video. I appreciate it. 
If you're not already, please hit that subscribe button. This is just the beginning of what I want to do. Over the next few years, I want to help thousands of people. And by subscribing, you help me do that. Let's all do some good. And there's a video right here over Chris's head. Tap on it. It'd make me really happy. I'll see you tomorrow. Once or twice, but I think it's here to stay.